Another type of chart we can create is pie or donut. Let's see how we can do that. We go to the chart page of the application in which we want our chart. We click on admin panel. And then on charts. For example, let's say we want a chart that displays the amount of the opportunities by sales stage in 2021. We click on new chart. And select the type of chart we want to create, in our case generic. We enter the name of the chart. The handle will be used by the automation scripts, so it cannot have special characters or spaces. We will enter the name of the chart without special characters or spaces. We can choose a color scheme for the chart. For example, let's type T to speed up the search. And select Tableau 10. Then, we select the module which contains the data that we want to display on the chart. We select Opportunity, because that is the module that contains our sales data. We can also filter the data by using the filter options. In our case we choose to show the data related only to the current year. We can also customize the filter with the box below, but this time we leave it this way. Since we are going to create a pie or a donut chart, we won't have the y-axis to set up and we will skip this section. In dimensions, we will select the field which contains the data that will be visualized on the chart. This drop-down will contain only the data types that can be used as values for the x-axis. We select stage, which contains the data we want. Also, by checking this box, we will skip the missing values. In metrics, we will choose which data and how that data will be processed to be plotted on our chart. First, we choose amount, since we want to plot the amount divided by sales stage. We select the function sum, to process our data and compute the total for each sales stage option. Then, we select pi as the chart type. Let's see the preview by clicking on load data. If we pass the arrow over the chart, it shows the amount of the opportunities for each stage. For example, the negotiation stage has opportunities for 282,000 euros. If we want to change the chart type, we go back and select donut. In this case, we want to show the percent relative values of the amounts instead, so we check show relative value. Also, we want to see the percent always displayed on the chart. To do so, we check always show tooltips. We click on load data once more, to see the preview. Now we like our chart, so we click on save and close. To add this chart into a dashboard, we select pages. And then the page where we want our chart added. For example, home. We click on Page Builder. Then we select Add Block. And then Chart. We enter the title. Then we click on the Chart tab. Select the chart. And add the block. The newly inserted chart will show on the page editor. We can now move it where we like. And resize it if needed. To confirm the new layout of our homepage, we click on Save and Close. Our chart now will show on the homepage. 